Come into my parlor, send the spider to the fly. Tractor beam activated. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play. Oh, hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Beyond Good and Evil HD with me, Oxfu. And before we go on, I'm just gonna switch this. I did save. Okay. Um, because otherwise, I will be screwed. So, yeah, it's like any other space boss. Like, just treat it like Star Fox 64 and shoot it, shoot at the glowing parts. In fact, you can even lock on to them. Ha <laughs> ha Oh shoot, just look out for this guy. Cause this... it's crazy. Oh. Shoot. Well, yeah, shoot. <laughs> but no, seriously, shoot, look out for these lasers because... They will take a chunk out of your life, quite a big chunk. Fortunately, they go away when you shoot at, shoot at these weak spots, but still. Oh, and that's right, he starts laying mines at this point, so again, just just look out. So, look out. <laughs> what is that, like, the third pony joke that I've made this entire Let's Play? Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. I don't have a way to go back or forth. I can't go on the other side. There, there's really no way for me to do that. I, I can't. Okay, there we go. Haha. -ha. Need to wait for you to flip. I see. There we go. All right. No, I didn't want to go in here. Heal, heal, heal. That's what I wanted to do. And take them out. Aha! You are screwed! You have li little to no health left. What are you going to do now, Spider? Spider! He is our hero! Spider! Step on Spider! Spider! I can't remember any of the other words from that song, so... I won't even try- Oh my goodness! Final Smash time. <laughs> What are you sending to us? I don't care, Hillian Word. We're halfway through a battle with a giant space spider. Have to launch the hovercraft if we want to turn off the track. Oh, so I was wrong. Ow! This actually is not the end of the hovercraft use. Because we still got this part. Right? No! No, 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 no. What I'm trying to do is push this barrel into you. Because I don't want to use those mines, because they're scary. Okay? They're scary, I said it. No, go this way. You know what? Screw it. Ah! Alright. It's really weird, though, that they leave a place for you to actually be able to dock inside their war weapon. No, I need to switch my controls back. Ugh. And I should only need to set them back one more time. No, two more times. But, you know what? It's worth it because we didn't die during that fight. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Okay, take care of him. Take care of him. Okay, don't take care of him, Double H. Double H, charge! Charge! Double H, charge! Don't do anything, Double H. That would be completely useful. No, really? What are you doing, Double H? <laughs> what the heck is this? What the heck is this? Double H and them are just having a little standoff over there in the corner. Oh, okay, now you're deciding to do something. After we're almost done with t dealing with these guys, jeez. Ow. 
Feel like doing something now, Double H? It looks like you might. Thank you. Thank you for finally gaining yourself low enough to be able to help us fighting the Alpha Sections after we've been fighting them for almost an hour now. Okay, half an hour, but still. Jeez. What were you hoping for, huh? Everyone you ever loved is already dead. Your mother and father, the pig, and all those little brats. <laughs> We've sucked them dry of all their fluids so that we could live longer. <coughs> He's looking for you. He's been on your trail for centuries. Your days are numbered. May the angels of darkness rise to glory. <laughs> really? 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 That's your famous, famous last words? May the angel of darkness rise to glory! You can take a disc in the head. Oh wait, you're already dead? <laughs> we have to get back to the base. All the prisoners are still in there. And you know what, General Kex? You deserve every death that we could have given you. I would have killed you again had you not been impaled on no, a power conduit no or something crazy like that. What's that sound? Oh well, we'll find out once we get back to the beluga, won't we? Come on, and we go. Landing strip in sight, straight ahead. All right, let's go. Look out! They're sending in the cavalry. Sweet Jesus, they're everywhere! Oh crap! See, this is what I'm talking about. It's kind of like Katina. But don't worry, guys gonna be back some backup coming on the way. The cavalry is on its way. We're not just gonna be left out here to be shot like chickens. Especially because we've got no way to do any barrel rolls or flips. Do a barrel roll! I can't do a barrel roll! I'm just a hovercraft strapped to a spaceship! <laughs> I don't know how many you have to take out for them to actually arrive. I don't even know if it's time-based or based on how many you take out, but there are going to be guys arriving any minute now. Any second now. There we go. Alright, so now that we have the attention of the other guys taken, we can now come over here and land. And find ourselves face to face with another fight with Dom soldiers. I'm not gonna save. Got enough time. Oh, I guess we do have to use trip well. Oh, I guess we don't have another fight. We're just going right to the fight with the Dom's priest. Okay, guys. Let's do this. Come all this way. Prepared all this time. We can do this. Finally, come back to me. You have served your master well, John. You alone have brought the Hillians to me. They have followed you blindly, Miss Jade. Dorthal Parker. No. It's a trap. <laughs> it's a trap. <laughs> you think you are. The pain has hidden your origins from you. Jay, no! Don't listen to him. No, Paige, we already brought you back to life once. I don't think so. 
All right, so we got a little. Oh, so guys, this is the final boss fight. <laughs> um, this is the final fight of the game, and before we take on the big guy, we've got a few of his minions that we do gotta take out first, just to show that we can hit them once or twice. These guys really are the gonna be the easiest part of this game because again, we just gotta smack them a couple times. All right. Let's see if I can remember how to actually fight this guy. Oh, come on. I think I figured it out. I think we gotta use the same attack that we used from the beginning. Oh, come on. Come no. Come on. No. Oh, actually, I see what we have to do. Okay, I was wrong. What we have to do is shoot these at him? Yes. Yes. Yes, there we go. Okay. Again, it's been a while, so... Can you really blame me? No, no, get those out of the way! Okay, that's not it. Come on, super action that. Super action! Oh, come on. I have no idea how we're supposed to get those crystals out of the way. There's gotta be some way to do it. Okay. There we go. But... Okay. Okay. There's two. Can we hit him now? Come on, we can hit him now, right? There we go! That's right. Feel the burn. <laughs> the burn of my M disc launcher. No. Oh God. Now it's just the, now it's just you and me. Come here, buddy. Kick your ass <laughs> for doing what you've done to my friends and my family. I don't think so. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. No, 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 no. I can't hit you when you're above me. No, no. I got K-Buffs. That's my secret power. What's yours? And I got a stick that I'm gonna shove in your eyes. Go. No. Ha. I'm better. Ah, no. 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 Gotcha. 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 Okay. Uh... Anything else that you're gonna do? Okay. Next stage. What do you got for me? Oh, okay. More of these. Ah, uh, no! Okay, they only take one hit at least. Because otherwise, if these were like the regular Alpha Section soldiers, I'd be I'd be screwed. Oh, they hit hard though. Jeez, it's two hearts a hit. Come on, get down there. I'm not afraid to hit a friend. It's not my fault that you're suffering. I'm about to I'm I'm about to free you. You're losing control of your spirit, Okay, so at this point the controls reverse. I forgot about that. <laughs> or they'll do other weird stuff. Which I I think is really nice because yeah, it, it does give you the, the idea that you're losing control, but it's not hard. It makes it harder, but it doesn't make it much harder. Just keep hitting. Come on. There we go! Final blow! Did we do it? We 
think we did it. We did it! Yes! And that, guys, is how you defeat Dom's Priest. Really, I don't think he has a name, but the Dom's Priest. And look, we got a trophy! Beyond Good and Evil! <laughs> We were able to do it. We were able to bring everyone back to life. Everyone we've met. We can't forget the best of our comrades. A little late for the party, Morpheus. it, guys. That is beyond good and evil. I want to thank every one of you that has stayed with me this long to actually see the end of this Let's Play. Oh my goodness, this has been such a, an honor to be able to Let's Play this game, because, because it's just given me so many memories with this game. I mean, I really don't know what to say at this point, because you know, you all know how much I love you. As subscribers, as other Let's Players. And you all know how much I love this game. Because everything about it is beautiful. Even the, even the ending music. I mean, usually you get some sort of cheesy tune at the end, but no, we're treated to one of the most beautiful soundtracks in the entire game. This is this is one of my first Let's Plays. It is the second one that I've finished. The first one being Shadow of the Colossus, but this is the first one that I'm proud of finishing. And I'm just I'm just I I, I had a lot of fun playing this and I'm really happy it's over. But I'm gonna be I'm gonna miss it a lot. There's going to be so many memories just coming back and playing this. It's going to be like... Paige. The heartbreak losing you at the end. And then thinking we lost you again. Double H. Seeing you for the first time. You and your... Carlson and Peters. The Mama Go Brothers. The Slaughterhouse. The Beluga. Even General Kex. Because as silly a guy you are, that was a damn good chase scene. <sighs> I can't believe it's over. Well, it's not quite over. We've got something left after the credits, but... You'll see. You'll see what I'm talking about. I guess I should probably talk about what my next Let's Play is going to be after this. I've got it narrowed down to two. I'm not sure which I'm going to start right after this. But one, one is a Game Boy Advance game. 
the other is Game Boy Color game. And I think what I'm gonna do is go with the Game Boy Color game. And it's gonna be it's not gonna be it's gonna be a very fun game. I'm gonna have a lot of fun playing it. Not many people at least I found not many people have played this. Just because I I'm not I don't know why. Why not? <laughs> I think it's one of the best games put out for the Game Boy Color. But it's gonna be fun. That's all I'm gonna say now. I gotta record some of that. Probably after I finish recording this. So. I'm getting up there in subscribers too. I was actually recording a um, 50 subscriber special with Splittable Infinite of the other night. But unfortunately, the audio wasn't great. It's just like an assault upon your ears to hear it. You can make out what we're saying, but it's really low quality uh, audio for the for the speech. So I think what I'm going to actually I'm going to ask her to redo it for me with my 100 subscriber special. Also, I've got another treat coming your guys' way. Her Chromium and I recorded something else the other night. It's just going to be fun. Oh, look, it's a picture of Paige. Well, I can't tell what the other chalk picture is. Oh, it's a picture of the lighthouse. That's that's cute. Wait, what's that? Come on, keep turning, keep turning. I want to see... I don't know what that is. Aww. Well, there's a picture of the lighthouse. I, I can't tell who the two people are, though. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Oh my goodness, listening to the music now. I love all of the music in this game. There's just so much great music. I mean, listen to it. They're using so many instruments. They're not just staying to, like... They're not electronically producing it, and they're not staying to, like, a regular orchestra. They're implementing tons of exotic instruments just to add that feel of exoticism, but it's a very simple tune. It's not... It's almost like a sea shanty tune. So. This is a long... This is a long um, credits now that I think of it. <laughs> oh my goodness, I just remembered... Um, during that montage last time. Master Kai! We, we're getting shot at! <laughs> because of the, the boat horn. Boat horn. In the background. Oh. What else do I have to talk about with this Let's Play? Not really. Not much, really. I mean, I guess what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have a, um, a special video. Um, one more video, I think, where I go through the different Iris discs, and I just take a look at, well, the different M discs that we've gotten, and I just take a look at those. Maybe I'll re revisit the Pearl game as well. Um, well, leave it in the comments if you want to see that, because I haven't really... Nobody's really said anything about whether they want to see that or not, so... Just let me know. Um... No more music? Come on. Give us give us some more music. The music's nice. Really, how, mo how long are these credits gonna go? Does DMAS Technical Coordinator, what the hell? What, what is that? Um... Department of Marketing International Services, Certification Manager, Corentin Francoise, Francoise, Salayan Paiva, Anis Bourgeois, Bourgeois, oh no, Bourgeois, 
Brent Wilkinson, U.S. Director of Product Planning and Senior Customer Support. Shannon Kokoska, North American Age Rating Manager. Oh yeah, this was rated T for Teen for Comic Mischief. Ben White, Edwin Z, I hate that guy. North American Age Rating Specialist. Ch, Edwin. Pierre Lescheich, Studios Operation Director. Really? Can't you just do, like, a scroll thing, make this go a little faster? I don't care about Sebastian Odasso or Helene Jouguet. <laughs> or Frédéric Bolot, head of CMK. Oh. Are they going to show the sunset again? Opens with the sunset. Closes with the sunset. That would just be beautiful. Now, wouldn't it? Actually, what would be beautiful? Is if it opened with the sunset and closed with the sunrise. But yeah, guys, that's been Beyond Good and Evil. It's been a great run. Do, are you not done with the credits? Really? You just said Beyond Good and Evil. I thought that meant it was the end. What's left? Story. Okay. Directors. Okay. Dialogues. Okay, I get it. Let's move on. I don't want to press X, because I don't want to skip past... There's a cutscene at the end. That's what I don't want to skip past. Because, as you know, they're working... They're supposedly working on a Beyond Good and Evil 2. And it looks phenomenal. That's what the... That's what the, um... There, there's... A little teaser at the end. That's what it's leading up to. At least I think, unless they completely forgot about it. But Paige is in the next game, too. And it deals with Paige, so... You know, you, you really got to think about it, too, because he said that he was chasing her for hundreds of years, and yet Paige supposedly took her in as his daughter when she was young, when her parents had been killed. So does that mean, like, the spirit came in and took possession of Paige when she was a little... Uh, of Jade when she was a little girl, and then just stayed with her through adulthood? I really don't know. Does that mean there are two spirits that struggle within her? I, I have no idea. Characters modelization. I, I, I get it. Let's move on. <laughs> I think it's near the end, though, because... I think this is about where the cutscene starts. Maybe. Can't really be sure now, can I? Um... I don't want to say anything about it, but yeah, people have been wondering where the Beyond Good and Evil 2 is going to come in, because they released trailers for it like in 2007 2008 so they re-released this and again I cannot this is phenomenal I mean even as much as I complain about the thumbstick control for the camera this is a phenomenal game they put it on on PlayStation Network for only like ten dollars I can't be happier with it I'm so glad that I got it when I did oh look we got a picture of the moon from out, right outside the moon. Oh, what's this picture? Come on, come on, scroll faster. Aw, it's Wolf. Hi, Wolf. Who's that up there? I see Paige and one of the kids. And... Oh, wait, Paige? <gasps> Oh my god, I forgot about that. Double H got married to the the, the Catwoman from um, the Iris Network. I completely forgot about that. Oh my god. That is a wedding, right? Looks like one. Maybe not. <laughs> and what's this down here? Page, Double H, and... Can't tell who that is yet. Um, what is that? Oh, that's just Wolf. With... Oh, chasing after a beetle or something. Oh. <laughs> Look at the little kid chasing after Double H with his stick. I'm gonna be like Jade! Haha! <laughs> Conquered Wolf, too. Oh, that's like a half-dog, half-human guy. That's pretty cool. 
Haha, <laughs> someone can't take pictures of Paige, I see. Or Double H, I guess. Oh, come on. I've stopped. Okay, I think this is the... I think this is it. Yeah, I think it just focuses in on this last picture. This one here with Jade, Paige, and I believe Double... Nope, just Jade and Paige. I think that's it. And it goes to the cutscene. Hopefully, because... You know what? We've been looking at this for far too long. And I just want to get to the cutscenes now. Okay. Big titles. Okay, special thanks. It means we're almost done. Okay, special thanks. It means we're almost done. Okay, special thanks. That means we're almost done, right? <laughs> and to actually look around, because I don't know. I had no idea where my um, controller was. Okay, I think we're back at where we started with this, so let's... Aha! Cutscene time! Here we go, finally! Oh, it does start with the sunrise. That is such a nice touch. It's, it's like a new beginning. Page. What's wrong? Okay, guys, that's been Beyond Good Needle, and thank you very much for watching. I can't tell you how much it, it means to me. And again, I think I'll do like one special episode of this or something. And then that'll be it. That'll be the end of Beyond Good and Evil. Thank you, everybody. And take it easy.